My children, you must fight. What are you doing? Fight back. Hurry up and attack. You won't lose against this opponent. I can see it. You've lost the world to fight. I suppose this time, it's inevitable. No one is expected to instantly overcome grief and fear. You can learn from your mistakes, even if you fail. Your struggle will not have been in vain. I'm sure next time will be different. I will help you overcome these hardships and fear. I will always be here, watching over you. Aww, this is where we part. Until you awaken once more. Until then, rest well, my children. Oh wow. Utilizing this power is more than they can handle after all. The fault is my own. I should have used the children's lives more wisely. Of course, winning battles is important, but don't lose sight of our mission. Next time, I shall guide them properly. This battle has led to an unfortunate ending. Nevertheless, mysterious powers surrounding this world can turn back time. Let's retry from before the last battle. Turn back for the children. You are now just before the last intermission you played. Now let's retry this intermission. Okay. Huh? Are you crying? Don't what do you me. mean? Because there are tears on your face. Huh? Oh, you're right. I wonder why. Jeez, did you fall asleep in dream or something? Everyone is tired. No wonder you might fall asleep. You must have had a sad dream, huh? Walt, are you sad? No, May. I'm fine. But what is this? This weird feeling. The children do not realize time has been turned back. Experience gained prior to this will be lost. However, by increasing the children's affinity and strengthening the turnus during the intermission, you may be more prepared for the battle than last time. I hope May doesn't feel anxious. Since I'm the oldest, she can always feel safe and rely on me. Increase the affinity between two children by talking to them. Use them all to talk to May. First, I want to upgrade this. I can't. Okay. Fire and the sound of booms are scary. I don't like it. Aw. Maul to increase attack. Oh, okay. Malt and May's affinity increased to level 2. The children's support effects in battle will increase along with their affinity. This icon will appear every time their affinity level reaches a certain point. This is your chance to trigger a link event. Talk to May with the character whose icon is displayed. Malt. Hey, Mom. Um, what's up? Why are you so jittery, May? What kind of people were Mommy and Daddy? Huh? Mom and Dad? Yeah, I don't remember them much. That's right. They went to paradise when you were just a wee little thing. Oh, uh, are you feeling lonely? I don't know, but I've got Grandma, Grandpa, and you, so I'm not that lonely. Right, you are. We just have to hurry and rescue them, huh? Uh-huh, I bet they were lonely without us. Uh-huh, I bet you're right. Malt maze link to tag required. Link events occur when children have an affinity level 2 talk to each other. It doesn't seem like any enemies are around, so let's check out the Turnus a little bit more. Talking to children or using facilities will consume action points. The remaining action points available during an intermission is displayed at the top left of the screen. Make good use of the limited AP to strengthen both the children and the Turnus. Okay, now's my chance to thoroughly Okay. What the heck is this one? Yes. <laughs> oh, I leveled up. And engineering. Yes. Okay, just leveled up. Yes. I want to invent something that would benefit everyone's... Oh, that's probably... I'm scared, but I have to be strong for everyone. The Tarnus is big like a castle in my books. There's a super good way to lose weight. Uh... That's... Let's have fun dancing. It will save the village. I'd swear it. I want to be friends with everyone, but can I? I'm sure you can. Okay, 
What? Shields You're down. joking. This tank seems stronger than the others. Everybody, watch out. Oh, oh, this is the part. You're already surrounded by our garrison. I do not relish fighting pointlessly. Just surrender. So, depending on how you fight, you might be able to defeat the enemy without using the soul. Mm. Examine the enemy. Find its weakness. <laughs> that moving part up there. It seems they rather us not attack mm. there. All right. Let's focus our attacks there. We've got to try something. To defeat cards, we'll use all resources in the tournament and the children. Battle tip one, aim for the weakness to tower. Attack and deactivate the tower to prevent it from healing the main body. Battles, take events is funny. Okay, so you can still attack while defending and it's effective with fighting strong enemies. Sure the defender. Okay, you can use link attacks for setting characters with high affinity. With the same gun turn. Link attacks can be used when the link attack gauge of a pair with high affinity, same gun turn. Well, they have high affinity, so let's use the formation screen to place them at the same dairy. Oh, okay. Attacker. children really operating it? Haha, <laughs> would you look at glorious Colonel Pretzel beaten by weird children? Yeah, we did it. We won. Did we do it? Alright, haha. <sighs> I'm so relieved. It makes me really hungry. Dude, do you ever think of anything besides food? Do you think that Berman soldier's dead? Well, what do you think, guys? We just killed someone. Yes, you did. Ooh, new skill. Awesome. We just killed someone. The children realized if they wanted to save so their they families, the they would have no other choice but to board that machine, face the Berman army, and take the lives of enemy soldiers. This time, you succeeded all on your own. I'm so proud of you. Many more enemies will stand in your way. Defeat them without remorse, or you and your precious families will perish. Everyone will die? Struck by this cruel reality, the children stood in quiet resolution. Mm. So this is war. It tarnishes is equipped with a formidable weapon, the Soul Cannon, capable of defeating any enemy. However, in order to function, it requires bioenergy. In other words, a single person's life. What? I hope you won't need to use it, but if it's the only way to avoid everyone's death, you mustn't have a tape. Although you may regret your actions in the moment, hesitation will only lead to suspicion. Death, I promise. I will do everything in my power so it doesn't come to that. The children couldn't comprehend everything the boy said, but this much was clear. If they hesitated, everyone would die. This horrifying reality fell heavily on their shoulders. Special Gasco Invasion Forces Berman HQ. I see. The devil from the old tales was in deep slumber. If that is so, then the lost god can also return to this land. Ha ha ha. You did well in your final moments, Colonel Pretzel. This is truly your most valuable achievement. Night without end. Aw. Clear chapter one. Wait, she's a cat? A new entry has been added to the Berman reports. Summon up villages and gather information from villagers. Select enter village. All major cities have suffered catastrophe, damage due to attacks by the Berman army. Those who fled, however, created small satellites like this in various locations. People try to make the most of their lives while distancing themselves from the gaze of the Berman soldiers. Money is useless during war. You got something to trade? Barter. You can exchange lower level items you no longer need for higher level items. You can also check the status of the tank while closely watching. 
Oh, wow. The war broke out all of a sudden, didn't it? But being prepared means no worries. At the very least, you should prepare for anything. Hey you, do you know about the comic pages? The Adventures of Cyrus is very so good. If you've never read it before, then here, you've gotta read it. Get other issues by talking with visitors. You can check the obtained comic pages by going to the library in the main menu. Let's see. Les Adventures de Cyrus Mystery Deluxe. The Adventures of Zeus, the Banishing Key Art. Zeus, a, a courageous 15-year-old boy with a sense of justice, when push comes to shove, his wit is his weapon. Trema, Zeus's buddy and female pet owl that understands spoken language. Mela, Zeus's slightly childhood friend. She tends to be a little too helpful. You're just too helpful, Malia. The Doctor, an oddball inventor. He creates some amazing inventions even though they usually break right away. Dang, are you really useful? Inspector Kathy, a friend of Seuss's father, whereabouts unknown, who understands Seuss well. Madame, a son, widow of an antiques dealer. She looks sus. Professor Burry, previously an archaeology professor, he was banished from the academic society after his fraud was discovered. A money grubber. Definitely looks like it. Count Nuvelu. A mysterious man in a mask. He persuades Professor Burry to come along and steal treasure. Of course. Okay, Adventures of Cyrus Episode 1. Research Institution, the foundation of innovation. Oh ho, my small sized radio prototype is complete. The vanishing incident at the Lumiere mine. Incidents of livestock and property suddenly disappearing continues. Doctor, that's awesome. We can finally hear the news now. It's nice and small. Perfect to carry around. It gets hot quickly, so it needs some improvement. Hopefully it won't explode again, right? Ho ho! Knock knock knock! Uh, hi, Inspector Coffee. Ah, I knew you'd be here, Struce. And uh, who is this? I brought you a client. Hello, pleased to meet you. My name is Asan. My dearly departed husband was an antique dealer while going through her husband's personal effects. She apparently found something strange. I thought maybe this would be a good job for you. Well, I have to get back to work. Excuse me. Okay, Inspector, leave it to me. The strange thing I found looks like a screw. And it came with this message. A bejeweled screw? And you say a message? Oh my. Do we continue? Wow. With the arrival of the dawn, the Gasco invasion will begin under the starry sky. Beyond this window, I could see the airship fleet, the pride and joy of our country, carrying a garrison of soldiers and weapons towards the battlefield. Colonel General Jivan Hax is the supreme commander of this operation. Not long ago, he served as a mere aide, bold and young. However, in a blink of the eye, he was promoted to lead the entirety of this massive invasion. I suppose it's not surprising, considering his calm judgment and ambition he shows with his words and actions. If I had to say it, ever since he was removed from under my supervision, his cruelty seemed to grow. I have a feeling this mission will be just as rough as the last. Malt Marzipan, Grace Kenninu, male, 12 years old. The oldest child from Petite Mona, ever since his parents died of, from an illness, he's been living as a mushi herder on his grandparents' farm with his little sister May. He has a strong sense of responsibility and shows great courage. Hana fond Fondant Race, feline Neko, female, 12 years old, most childhood friend, a thoughtful girl with a compassionate grown-up nature. She is kind to everyone, she loves to read and enjoys taking care of people. Someday, she hopes to become a doctor. Kyle Bavari was fully an echo, male, 11 years old. Due to his parents' circumstances, he moved from the capital to the unfamiliar countryside. Even though he often has a bad attitude and a foul mouth, he is actually quite gentle and lonely. He has a crush on Hannah, and I sacrificed him first. Boron Brish, an echo, male, 10 years old. He is one of five children born to his father and mother, a farmer and cook, respectively. Always calm, he dislikes fighting. Although he's a big boy, he often acts like a scaredy cat, crybaby. Socks, race, can you? Male, 10 years old, fascinated by mechanics and a desire for knowledge. He is driven by curiosity. 
He is easily excited by topics on knowledge, often speaking rapidly even though he is usually more reserved. He has difficulty talking with girls. May, Race Kanu, female, four years old. Aw, she's a baby. Bob's little sister, the youngest of the crew. Cheerful and steady, she grew up without letting the death of her parents affect her. She has a friendly personality, but likes her brother the most. But there's more characters? Pretzel, Race, Kanu, male, 49 years old. With his very strict militaristic nature, Pretzel is a man of morals who is more likely to put his life on the line for his homeland than his own self-interest. Even though he is a compassionate side, he follows orders and cannot extend sympathy towards any enemy on the battlefield, not even children. Oh, okay. Hey, Maltam. What's up? Why are you so jittery, me? What kind of people were mommy and daddy? That is so cute. 